Welcome to this video on how to install JES on a Mac. Now there are two steps. First, we need to install Java version 8, and then we'll install JES. And as you can see, there's a link here to download Java and a link here to download JES, and I'll also put them in the description below. Now to download and install Java, after you click the link, you wanna make sure that you have a JDK version 8 selected, and that you've also selected this hotspot, JVM as well. And then you can click on this button to download the installer. Now hopefully you'll find this in your downloads folder, um, or it could have downloaded to onto your desktop. But then all you need to do is double click on this. You can also uh, click on it through your browser and you will get a installation dialog. And then you just go through this wizard to uh, install this on your computer and you go ahead and click install. Now that you have Java installed, we can download and install JES, and you just go down here. Um, by the way, here's some instructions that you wanna pay attention to, and I'll walk you through this after we download it. And uh, down here, you wanna grab the Mac OS version of this, and you just click this to download it. Now, I think by default, after you download it, it will unzip it. If not, you just need to double click on it to uncompress the file, and then you have this folder it will probably be in your downloads folder or wherever your browser decides to download uh, things to. And I like to just drag it to the desktop. Now you just need to drag this folder into your applications folder. Now you might find the applications folder on your sidebar right here. So you could just click on it and drag and drop that in. If you don't see it over here, just go up to this go and you'll see the applications folder right there. And clicking on that will bring you to the applications folder and you just need to drop that folder inside of your applications folder. Now, whether or not you have uh, Catalina, the latest version of macOS, or a previous version, you is gonna decide on which one of these two you wanna click on to start your, uh, to start JES. Now, this one is if you have pre-Catalina, anything before the latest version of macOS. And this one right here is if you have Catalina, is the one you wanna double click on. Now, how you can tell is you just go up to this Apple and you go to about this Mac right here. And of course you see Catalina right here. So if you see Catalina right there, you know you have Catalina. If you see something else, then you know you have pre-Catalina. Another way to check is this version uh, 15 is Catalina. Anything before 15 is pre-Catalina. And once again, you'll find these files inside that folder you just dragged in. And since I have Catalina, I'm gonna double click on that. And um, you'll probably see this dialog come up right here and you just click okay. But now that you've done that, you can go up to the Apple and go to system preferences. And once this pops up, click on security and privacy. And you'll see JES was blocked because it's, it is not from an identified developer. And you can click open anyway right here to open it up. After clicking this button, you'll now have the option to open it right here. Now, once you, it launches up, you should see this screen right here, and that means you've got it installed. So you can type your name up here as proof that you've installed this on your computer and then take a screenshot. Now, if you're on a Mac, you can take a screenshot by opening up preview, and then you can just go file, uh, take a screenshot from selection, or you can take the entire screen or from a window, and then you just highlight what you want to take a screenshot of, and it should save that screenshot on your desktop so that you can turn it in. Now, if you happen to already have a later version of Java installed on your computer, then it might not work when you try to open JES. And in this case, uh, you'll probably get an error that looks like this right here. And I'm gonna show you how to fix this. Now, this is probably pretty rare that you've already installed Java on your computer, but if you have and you get this error, this is how you fix it. Let's go up to this Go menu and go down to this Go To folder. And you wanna type slash library slash Java right here. And then you'll see this Java virtual machines folder inside of there. And you probably, if you already have Java installed and you see this later version, this is the one that we already installed, uh, that I showed you how to install. If you see this later version, you wanna click on that. 
and then into the contents folder and see this info.plist, you just want to rename it. So you can right click and click rename. And at the end, you can just put a dot disabled right here and it will ask you for your password or uh, so go ahead and type your password and then it will be renamed and it's okay if it adds this dot p list onto the end. Now, if you wanna undo this, just rename it to back to info dot p list. But once you've done that, you should be able to double click on your file um, by going back to your uh, JES and double clicking on the right file again and JES should open up without a problem.